All right, so it is a talk of the firehouse. Talking about a mustache that you'll soon see that one Whitehall firefighter is sporting. And with your help, he could win a big award. But as TNTV's Lacey Crisp explains, there's a deeper story behind these handbars. If I'm not talking about CrossFit or my faith or something like that, I'm, I'm, I'm talking about my mustache. Take a look at those handlebars. Oh, they like it. Whitehall firefighter Sean Stauffer has the upper lip when it comes to stashes. What does maintenance for this look like? Maintenance? I'll tell you what, it's really not that bad. He's hoping you like it as much as he does. It's a social media based type competition. Stauffer has made it to the top 12 in a mustache competition. Each of the finalists gets a month in a calendar to raise money for charity. I'm Mr. November. Voting for your favorite lip tickler is open now through Saturday night. Every time I see my mustache, I just, that's what I think about, like what I've ever come. For Stauffer, it isn't just about looks, it's about soul. Like many first responders, he suffered from PTSD and was an alcoholic. He started growing out his facial hair when he got sober. Just a special place in my heart for the bridge. The first responders bridge, that is, the nonprofit that helped him through his struggles. Now Stauffer wants to help the bridge. That's like my number one why um, that I want to win this. The proceeds of his win will be donated to the group. While he hopes you get a laugh at his caterpillar, face fitting, lip toupee, or whatever nickname you have, he's serious about the cause that spurred Whiskers growth. I don't have any other why. That's why I want to win. In Whitehall, Lacey Crisp, 10 TV News. Oh boy, all right. If you want to vote, we have a link right now. You can find it on our 10 TV app. Vote once, twice, as many times as you can. Here